What's up everybody? Ricky Carruth here. Welcome back to my channel. So today I want to honor the great Brian Buffini, one of the most legendary, in my opinion, probably the most legit of the legendary real estate coaches out there in the industry. I really, I haven't really talked about Brian Buffini whatsoever in videos, online, anywhere. Um, but I will have to admit right now that I have listened because I'm a Remax agent, and you know he's a he's a trainer uh, mostly for Remax agents, and uh, so and my my broker he teaches the Brian Buffini system every year to our, our agents at at our office, the new agents coming in. And so I've been exposed to a lot of Brian Buffini's content. I've never actually went through a course. As a disclaimer, I've never went through a course. I never paid for any of his coaching, but I've watched a lot of his videos and I've read a lot of his content. And I have to say it, it lines up a lot with what I do with relationships over transactions, um, you know, referrals. He's about building a huge referral business, which how do you build a referral business? You have to build relationships. The people have to view you um, as an extended part of their family, you know, to feel comfortable enough with you to give you those referrals. And he's really good. I really like him. So there you have it. He's a coach that I really respect. Um, so I wanted to, to share with you guys one of my favorite quotes that I heard him say out of all the videos I watched of him as I was coming up in the industry. And then as I got into coaching, um, I continued to watch some of his videos. I actually watched a lot of his videos when I was actually learning to uh, be a public speaker. You know, I wanted to learn kind of how he started his speeches and his demeanor and his body language and stuff. So I watched uh, a lot of his stuff for many different reasons. Real estate motivation, real estate fundamentals, public speaking fundamentals, and so on and so forth. So um, hats off to Brian Buffini. Thank you so much for your contribution to the industry and to the world. And I hope I meet you one day. Let me just throw that out there. Um, we've never chatted back and forth on social media. I've never tried to reach out. Um, to you, Brian, but I hope at some point I do get to meet. It'd be nice to have you on my podcast or something like that. Before I get into my favorite Brian Buffini quote, I do want to share with you that I am the first completely free real estate coach. I've been a real estate agent for 17 years now. I'm still selling full time. I've sold over 100 properties a year since 2014 as a single agent. Still going, been number one. Remax agent in the state of Alabama three times, going for number four. And I'm just going to continue producing real estate sales, continue producing the best real estate coaching content on the face of the planet. So if you haven't subscribed already, please do so now and click that like button. Shoot me a comment and let me know who you are, where you're from, what market. You guys network a little bit in the comments there. On top of building the fastest growing real estate coaching program in the world, I want it to be a platform for you. I want you to be able to network with the other agents. Okay, we have free training. We have a Facebook group with over 20,000 members and growing. I have a full course, I have a 28-day real estate challenge, and a 90-day action plan. Everything is completely free and full access to me. The best way to get me is to DM me on Instagram, at Ricky Carruth. I answer every single DM there within 24 hours. So if you have questions or if there's anything I can do for you there, please reach out. So what I want to do is I'm going to actually share the clip of the video of my favorite Brian Buffini quote right now. So you guys enjoy this and I'll see you in a minute. So one of the biggest problems we hear about is a tight inventory. Yeah. What are you telling your clients on what to do about that? Well, I think, look, here's a question. How many of you are in the business five years or more? Let me see your hands. Okay. And uh, so... We, we have a certain way of doing business, right? We get a buyer and we're used to going to the MLS and you go search and you go show and, you know, there's not as many available and there's multiple offers. And what happens is I hear this refrain, there's no inventory, there's no inventory, there's no inventory. So to me, the thing about it is there's all the inventory in the world. There's no listings. Did you guys hear what I just said? There's plenty of freaking inventory. There's houses everywhere. They're just not listed. So if you have a buyer, our, our 
mantra to our clients is go create your own inventory. Go create your own inventory. Don't get caught in the passive mindset. I searched, we didn't find anything, there's multiple offers. If you have a buyer, you know what they can afford, you know where they want to live, and there's not a house available in that market, go find it. Go find it. There's 250 homes in that neighborhood. Here it is. Mail them. Here's another concept, a brand new technology they've just reduced. Call a telephone. Why don't you try calling them? Why don't you send them a note? Why don't you go into the neighborhood and say, I have a legitimate buyer. If you're interested, I'd just like to come and show the buyer. This is not a solicitation for a listing. I'm, I'm interested in showing a buyer a home in your neighborhood. And if you happen to be one of those folks interested in selling, uh, I'd love to show them your house. Similarly, if I have a listing, and I, how many of you have had a listing that sold pretty quick? Let me see your hands. You need to market the daylights out of it. Hey, you know what? Guess what? I, I, we just sold the Robinsons, your neighbor's home, in four days, and we got 12 offers. Unfortunately, those 11 people who want to buy and live in this neighborhood, there's no homes for them to buy. Are you considering moving? And, and like these are radical techniques, Dave, right? I mean, no one's done anything like this in 30 years. This is all, this is hashtag freaking awesome, isn't it? Okay, so that was Brian Buffini and the founder of Remax, Dave Linegar, talking several years back. Um, I don't I forget exactly what year that was, but it was maybe five years ago. And uh, their presence on stage is something, isn't it? Since then, Dave Linegar stepped down. He gave the CEO position of Remax to Adam Contos, who I'm going to have on my podcast this week. So I'm very excited about that. But within that clip, was my favorite Brian Buffini quote, and that was that there's plenty of inventory out there. Houses are everywhere. They're just not listed. I love that. I already thought in that mindset. I, I was already, you know, before I heard the quote, I was already at a place in my business, in my life, where I realized business is 100% unlimited forever. Closings happen every day, regardless of market conditions. We are literally in one of the most secure uh, careers and professions out there. But it, it, this really struck me because I just loved how he said it and it made a lot of sense. And I'm glad that he said it on such a big stage that was at a Remax International Convention. And so he said that inventory is everywhere. Houses are everywhere. They're just not listed yet. And then he went further and stated another really good quote, which was, you got to get out there and create your own inventory don't have a buyer and then look on MLS and say, well, we can't find it. He said, get out there and create your own inventory. Even if you don't have a buyer, let's get out there, create our own inventory. This is what we need to do at all times, regardless of what the market's doing. If inventory's up, inventory's down, days on the market, sales, transactions, whatever's happening, we need to get out there and always be pushing to create our own inventory. This is the name of the game. And when we're going after listings, you know, a lot of people are just so focused on that, that when you talk to owners, it's just to go after listings. Property owners are the best buyers. They're the most efficient buyers. They already know what it's like to own property. They already know property taxes, insurance, upkeep. They already understand the entire game. Okay, they know the game and it's easy for them to buy another property. They just need an agent to kind of help them do the transaction. So these are your best, most efficient, most effective buyers, and the best way to spend your time is on property owners. To represent buyers and sellers. It's not just for sellers, it's for both buyers and sellers. So when he talks about going out there and talking to property owners and seeing what you can do to help them, see if they're interested in selling, telling them that, you know, we sold your neighbor's house in four days, didn't know if there's something that we could do for you. He's talking about circle prospecting, which is the core of my business. Okay, that's been the core of my business. I believe everything works. Okay, I believe expired for sale by owners, buyer leads, door knocking, sphere of influence, you know, whatever it is, everything works as long as it's focused on talking to more people. I don't care what it is, as long as it's focused on talking to more people, then it's gonna work. Okay, but this, what he's talking about is circle prospecting, picking out a neighborhood, picking out a subdivision and calling all the owners in that subdivision and seeing what we can do to help them. 
and letting them know that we're here to help them and then begin to build that personal brand and close a few deals in the process. So I wanna do three things for you right this second. The first thing is I'm gonna link a video below of a circle prospecting webinar that I did that explains the entire circle prospecting process, how to do it, the phone script, the whole nine yards, everything right there for you. The second thing I wanna do for you is link another video that's only about five minutes on how exactly to get phone numbers of any specific subdivision that you wanna get phone numbers in. Okay, and the third thing I wanna do for you is I'm gonna link another video of me making live circle prospecting cold calls. So you can see me in action, you can feel my demeanor, the tone of my voice, the speed of my voice, the script, how I'm doing it, why I'm doing it, the whole nine yards, and how I'm closing 100 deals every single year as a single agent. Now, I'm not gonna charge you for this, I'm just gonna give this to you for nothing and all I want for you to do with it is to take it, figure out how you can make it work for yourself, and then go succeed. That's it. That's the only payment for you back to me, is to take something that I'm doing, figure out how to make it work for you, and use it to succeed. I wanna hear about it. Please DM me on Instagram and let me know. It worked, I got a listing. Or, Ricky, I have a question about this. Whatever it is, don't be scared to reach out to me because I promise you, your messages and me helping you further with the more intricate details is what's keeping me going. Okay guys, be sure to like this video, subscribe, and comment below. Let me know if there's anything else in the world I can do for you today. Let's go!